Windows on the Steam Deck OLED is about to become a reality thanks to the update from Yang, Lawrence Yang at, over at Valve because he was asked by The Verge in an article, we did a video talking about how Valve and Steam are going to support Steam OS on non-Steam Deck hardware like the ROG Ally and potentially Lenovo Legion Go and other Windows handles out there. That's a big deal. Go watch my video on that. But there was a little tidbit in that article talking about What's the update on Windows on OLED Steam Deck? Because right now, the, only the LCD Steam Deck has all the drivers available for dual booting Windows. I actually enjoyed running Windows alongside Steam OS on my Steam Deck, my LCD Steam Deck. But right now, there's a lot of drivers missing on the Steam Deck OLED. It just doesn't work. I believe the speakers don't work. Bluetooth doesn't properly work. There's just a lot of things missing on this. But we've got an update, finally. Let's get into it. Quick shout out to all our members who are going to support everything I do on YouTube, the live streams, everything like that. Consider clicking join down below, getting your name on every live stream and every news video like this and join these wonderful people here. It will hopefully grow the channel bigger, do more things, do better things and just be better all around, right? But if you don't want to or can't, um, just click like, subscribe, click the bell icon. But if you want to, if you want to support, click join down below and become a member. Anyways, so this is what Lawrence Yang said. He says, as for Windows, we're preparing to make the remaining Windows drivers for Steam Deck OLED available. You might have seen that we're prepping firmware for the Bluetooth driver. There's no update on the timing for dual boot support yet, but it's still a priority, but we haven't been able to get to it just yet. So as you know, SteamOS 3 is gonna release the general release of SteamOS 3 that can theoretically install on non-handheld PCs as well. It's making good progress on that, but as far as dual booting is concerned, there's no update just yet for automatic, like an installer, a walkthrough, like a, you know, something that will help you dual boot, make it easier. They've not started working on that, but they have and are about to release the Windows drivers for Steam Deck OLED. So hopefully we're going to see a lot of YouTubers post tutorials and videos on how to dual boot. I'm not going to be one of them, although I might. Let me know in the comments if you want me to do a tutorial, but hopefully we're going to get dual boot support soon. It shouldn't be too too different to the old method. All we really need is the drivers now and we should be able to deal with between SteamOS and Windows. I love the opportunity to switch between both. I did on my old my old Steam Deck LCD. I love being able to play a little bit of Game Pass. I love being able to play Call of Duty Warzone, Call of Duty, a lot of games that have DRM issues with SteamOS and Linux. And just be able to even stream gameplay to YouTube and Twitch using OBS on my Steam Deck on Windows was also sick. So I'm looking forward to that. Let me know if you're excited. Let me know if you plan on dual booting Windows and Steam OS on your Steam Deck OLED when it comes out, when the drivers are available, or maybe you're already doing it and maybe either finding, you know, modified drivers that work or just doing without the Bluetooth and the speaker issue um, and putting your own headphones in. Let me know if you're already running Windows on your Steam Deck OLED um, because you can, you can just there's not drivers for everything yet and it doesn't run perfectly so let me know in the comments either way anyways guys i'm blazed okay like subscribe click the bell icon a little bite-sized update for you and i'll see you in the next video take care and consider clicking join and helping grow the community anyways i'll see you take care love you guys bye